Ludigo video. Hi everybody. Back Boy. in New York after my visit to Charleston and I brought some prizes home to try. First prize, carrot cake M&M's. Carrot Courtesy. Cake. White chocolate carrot cake. Of my mom and dad. My dad found them when he was in Florida. I brought them home for mom and then we found them in Charleston. And then the fabulous, we went to Cracker Barrel for breakfast when I got in. These are exclusively at Cracker Barrel. Cannot buy them anywhere else. Pancake and maple syrup. Jelly bellies. And then wasabi and ginger lays. Yeah. I don't know why the Vegemite's on the table. Because I always do that for Kaz. I figured I'd put some on the chip and because <laughs> oh. I'm retarded. Okay, so I'm curious. A special girl. White chocolate carrot cake. I gotta say I'm curious. Oh, they're big. Oh, they're big. Okay. Look, they're, they're large. I, I did not try these at home. Mom had mom bought like six bags because when I was Easter candy, we went to Walmart before the surgery. And by the way, mom's doing great. Just to update everybody in case you're curious. Ready? Um, but yeah. Definitely tastes like carrot cake. Mmm. I'm eating another. I'm not quite sure how I feel about it. Oh, you don't like white chocolate. But it's not chocolate. It's like state tax, but crap on me. But they're very sweet. They're, they're very carrot cakey. They're incredibly sweet. Um, but, oh man. They're carrot cakey. Yeah, that's you for sure. immediately get hit with the spice. Mm -hmm. The carrot spice, you know, the, what is it, the nutmeg or, nutmeg or whatever it's in carrot cake. Um, I made the mistake of taking five out of the bag. I don't think I can eat all five. Oh no, I can't either. Um, <laughs> but, and then you definitely taste the cream cheese yeah. flavor. But yeah, it de they, they really got it down. It definitely tastes like carrot cake. Yeah, they're flavor people. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. They got it. On point. Mm hmm. I cannot, I don't know if I can get any of them right now. You eat a wasabi ginger. Yeah. Now, if the, if white chocolate, I'm curious, because white chocolate, just as you don't know, is not true, because there is no such thing as white chocolate. It's like a white candy. I need to get that taste out of my mouth. But it's not, <laughs> why did I put another one in my mouth? <laughs> But it's not actually chocolate, so could we feed these to the dog? Not that I would want to, because it's too sugary, but because it's not actually chocolate. I'm just curious. I was walking around the street, hugging my Cheetos can. Don't judge her. Um. Ooh, I really that. Anyway, let's... I was pretty excited over the cheesy poops. I hadn't had those in a long time. These were mm -hmm. good. Yeah. Now, i got to say, I'm super excited about these. And like I said, exclusively at Cracker Barrel. And another very interesting little tidbit of trivia that I did not know. Apparently, you can only find Cracker Barrels at interstate exits. Or off interstate exits. You know? Um, I thought that was interesting. And I like the little American flag on it. Yeah. Made in the USA. Um, Please don't explode them all over again. That would be funny. Oh yeah, ooh, mm. like as soon as you, hello, pussy fight. No, pussy here. Oh, okay. Well, mean pussy here. All right. I'm excited. Those are awesome. <laughs> it could be waffles too. Oh yeah, absolutely. Any kind of um, breakfast pastry that you put maple syrup on. French toast. Mm-hmm. Pancakes. Because the maple syrup is very prevalent. The butter. I taste the butter. butter. This really tastes like pancake with maple syrup. Yeah, it does. Spot on. But Jelly Belly is incredibly spot on with their flavors. Everything from vomit to pancakes and maple syrup. Jelly Belly is seriously spot on. Yeah, I'm excited about these. Mm -hmm. I should have got more of these. Now I feel bad for not opening for Tristan when he wanted to find it. My nephew was outside and I said, no, no, I said, those are a present for Kim. Wobbly cat. Oh, God. Yeah, there we go. Now, are you going to try these? No. I heard they weren't spicy. Wasabi, see, it, it would be spicy wasabi. 
Ooh, yeah, see, there you go. No, not spicy. The good smell is good. How about if I try them? I mean, you know I'll be truthful because I don't want your stomach to be messed up. Wasabi and ginger. I know Lisa likes these. Mm-hmm. Little kettle club. Mm-hmm. 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 Why is it? Oh, four flavor finalists. Which one of the four flavor finalists? Mm-hmm. They're really good. Really good flavor. Excellent flavor. Don't know what I can describe it like in the sense of comparing it to something else. Kind of a uh, sour creamy, but with the punch. But there's no, there's not spicy, like hot. I'll eat my can of cheese. I don't really taste ginger. I am. Maybe it's one of those things afterwards. I will say, I'm feeling a little bit on my tongue. Just a little bit, but not, almost just like a pepper, in a sense, but a good flavor. But, oh, good. Um, so they're hit. If I ate them blindfolded, I wouldn't guess what it was. Oh, really? Mm -mm. I would. I know. would absolutely know this is carrot cake, and I would absolutely know that's pancakes absolutely. or waffles or syrup. But yeah, if I ate these blindfolded, I might actually go with like sour cream and onion first, or maybe like a sour cream and black pepper and onion, because I really don't taste ginger in them. But <laughs> um, oh wait. I got a serious bite of ginger. Yeah, that I think was one of them after effect kind of things. That were really weird. Yeah. Like you don't feel it until after you eat three buffalo wings. That was I mean that one was like all ginger on that one. That was weird. And because we miss our dear friend Kaz so much. Um you miss our more because you're eating that. <laughs> you hear that, Kaz? Oh god, what am I thinking? Ugh, what am I thinking? It's just going to be salty. I still want to take this to um, Charleston and do this with my nephews. You should. I feel... Very salty. Like I just licked the asshole over my nostrils. <laughs> my nostrils asshole. Who had eaten a bunch of Vegemite? Mm -mm. You know... I have a feeling they were cooking rhinoceros assholes when you were on vacation. <sighs> oh, that was badass! Oh. Mm. But you know what? My brain feels smarter. It's just brain food. Badass. Okay, so carrot cake and them. One to ten. What would you rate them? Ten. Ten. Mm -hmm. I would rate them ten on flavor. Right. In the sense of how they combine the flavor. Mm -hmm. But I'd probably take a couple points off just because they're way too sweet for me. I couldn't eat well, more than a few of them. It is candy. But they did. I know, but it's like even more sweet than like regular M&M's. I think. That, well, yeah. they nailed the flavor. Mm -hmm. These, I'm going to go to an 11. I would go We're to We're going to take it to an 11. What's 11? It's one more than 10. So, yeah, those are awesome. And these, um, I think would make us 7 because they're good and yummy, but... They're not, they're not in the flavor of wasabi, wasabi ginger. ginger. Right. Yeah. But they're good on the flavor. I can't quit eating them. Okay. Let's go. Um, yeah. I thought that was good. So that's all. Short and sweet. Back in New York. Um, and if anybody um, has like any ideas for things for us to try or anything like that, please feel free to uh, let us know. And um, yeah. Thinking about doing a rant video. A rant video. And oh, let's just add, because it is Sunday. Mm -hmm. What is it, April 12th? 12th. 12th? Mm -hmm. Well, Jesus, I lost like this whole week. I was losing days. But um, can we just say uh, Hillary 2016?